Hey, 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 Sharon Horton Awesome here, but you can call me Pajam Grandma and the beautiful button. She decided she needed to join me on the happiness video today. Now, she does make me very happy and she brings me lots of joy, but today is day 111 of our Do One Thing Every Day That Makes You Happy from this little journal book that I love and I can finally talk again a little bit. So, what have we got today? It's all about the drudgery test. What the heck is a drudgery test? Well, today's saying says, the test of a vocation is the love of the drudgery it involves. And Logan Pearsall Smith said that. And our challenge today says, the drudgery I love in my job. Now, those of you who know me know I don't have a J-O-B. I have my own business. And there are, of course, things in having your own business that suck. Things that you don't like. Things that are drudgery. For me personally, the things I don't like that are usually the things I'm not good at, but they're repetitive tasks, little bitty detailed things like accounting, things like that, uh, bookkeeping, keeping track of every little transaction, keeping track of every little detail and thing drives me batty. So I team up with people that love to do that part of it so that I don't have to. But the trick of any vocation, and owning your own business is a vocation, right? It's it, a Vocation is what we do, how we spend our time, how we make a living is how most people define it. But maybe you're a volunteer and, and it doesn't matter. You can define it any way you want. But drudgery is how do you handle the parts of that job or task or vocation or business that you don't love? Me, if it's repetitive, I automate it and outsource it, or I find some way to automate it. Um, Figuring out all the tech stuff, all the, again, it's a detailed little minutia things. Figuring out, and I've gotten really good at rolling with the changes in different platforms and different tools because it used to drive me crazy. Because, again, it's a detailed thing. So what is something that you would consider the drudgery or the not great side of what you do? And how can you find a way to be okay with that or at least like it so that you don't mind doing it? Because if you're good with the day-to-day -day mundane tasks of what it is that you do and how you spend your time, everything else falls into a place, into place, not well, it falls into a place too. So what can you appreciate today about what it is that you do? That's it. Go out, make it an awesome day. And I will, of course, be with you tomorrow. Bye. Be happy. You got this.